Recently, there have been many plot leaks for The Rise of Skywalker. They are popping up all over the place. Let's take a look at one of the first ones to make an appearance. Hello, what have we here? Hello there, welcome back to the channel where we love to talk about Star Wars rumors. Thanks for joining me in another video. This is the first of many videos I want to make on the plot leaks for The Rise of Skywalker. If you don't want any of the story to be given away, this is your spoiler alert. You have three seconds to leave. So first off, I just want to mention that this first plot leak has been completely recalled from my memory. And if I'm remembering it clearly, The Last Jedi was just at the tail end of its theatrical release or it might have just finished up. The script was allegedly leaked not long after J.J. Abrams had been announced as Episode 9's writer and director. The title for this movie wasn't even known at this time. I was amazed at how quickly he could put together a script for a movie that's as important to a bigger story as this one. Here it is, as best as I can remember it. Episode 9 takes place 3-5 to five years after the events of The Last Jedi. The leak says that the First Order have fully taken over the galaxy. Kylo Ren is actually a good leader and there is finally peace in the galaxy. The people in the Star Wars galaxy like having Kylo as their supreme leader. Resistance fighters are beginning to wonder what they are even fighting against. Leia is sure the First Order are still up to no good. She is on the lookout for information that will prove to the galaxy that the First Order are evil. The Mole offers Leia a chance to get the evidence she needs to prove that the First Order are bad. With this new information, Leia sends our main heroes out into the unknown regions to get this evidence. Our heroes have a run-in with an alien creature who can guide them through the treacherous unknown regions. The Resistance heroes then head to a planet where they find out how the First Order have so many resources. Apparently there's a massive factory on this planet run by slaves of the worlds conquered by the First Order. The Resistance try to free all the captives found on this planet. It's revealed that the First Order Mole is none other than General Hux. He is jealous of Kylo Ren being the Supreme Leader and Hux wants Kylo out of the way. Once Kylo is gone, Hux can then be the Supreme Leader. Kylo has sent the Knights of Ren out into the galaxy. Their mission is to hunt down all remaining Force users. Many of these Force users seek out Rey for protection and she trains them in her new Jedi Order. I have a vague recollection that a character called Mara will be in Episode 9 based on these leaks. For those of you who don't know her, Mara Jade was Luke Skywalker's wife in Star Wars Legends material. Mara helps Rey train Jedi in her new Jedi Order. We also find out that Poe has been Force sensitive this whole time. Rey and Kylo's minds are still connected via the Force and the two of them have fallen in love. Kylo finds out that Rey is pregnant with a love child. He becomes so jealous that he almost kills Rey in a fit of rage. We also see the involvement of the crime syndicates, including the Hutt Cartel. Jabba the Hutt's son, Rodder, who we see in the Clone Wars animated movie, has an important role in Episode 9. The Hutts team up with the Resistance to help them take down the First Order. There is a scene with Finn, Rose and Poe having dinner with the Hutts. DJ makes a return and is somehow involved with the Hutts, making life fun for Finn and Rose. At some point in the movie, Finn falls in love with a new member of the Resistance. As mentioned in a previous video, Finn's new love is a First Order spy. She has him wrapped around her little finger. During Finn's mission, she is able to stop him from performing a critical task. This then puts the whole Resistance in great danger of failing. She then turns him over to Captain Phasma who has more than a bone to pick with him. We will see a return to Naboo where Leia's funeral will take place. Leaks at the time also mentioned Lando will be making a return. This was before any official announcement had been made of Billy D. Williams reprising his role as Lando Calrissian. There was definitely more to this at the time of the leak, but this is the best my memory can serve me. With any plot leak or rumor, I'd say take it with a grain of salt, but take this one with a grain of midichlorian if you can. They're microscopic creatures and smaller than sand. 
I read or heard this over a year ago and may have blurred some plot points and completely forgotten others. At the time I came across these, which was in early 2018, I thought it was a great story. I definitely like it more than some of the most recent plot leaks. If you're still here, I want to thank you for watching the whole video. If you enjoyed it, could you please give me a like? What do you think of these plot points? Are there any leaks you'd like me to cover? Let me know by leaving a comment. If this is your first time here, please subscribe so you don't miss out on any Star Wars rumors. Don't forget that I have a small giveaway happening for reaching 66 subscribers. Make sure you get in before I reach 100. More information can be found in the link in the description. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one. And remember, it doesn't matter what galaxy you're in, Jesus is Lord.